People always say the dashboard trim is a pain to take off, so let's see how many screws are actually holding it in place. Do you think a mechanic could really deal with this many in just one minute? The first screw sits right under the dashboard, one on each side. The surface is wrapped in synthetic leather, not the hard plastic you see in most cars. The fourth screw hides under the center screen and the fifth one is below the headlight switch. Down at the very bottom, there are six more. These self-tapping screws need precise torque, just a little too much force, and the threads strip. Once that happens, the factory requires replacing the spacer or nut. Most repair shops would not go that far, which is why cars that have been opened up often end up making random noises later on. Next, we switch to an electric wrench to tighten the twelfth screw. It is tucked behind the glove box, and because of that tight spot, a special tool is needed. Most repair shops do not have one, so they work slower than the factory. Finally, the last screw is on the right side of the dashboard. 